Today we are going to waterfalls, rice paddies, and then to the yoga barn. Six bottom of the ninth in the World Series. Shut up. Two outs. For who? I think the Cubs are out. This is crazy. Let's hope they make it. Hundred and something years without winning a World Series. That right there is the waterfall that we just drove the motorcycle all the way out here to see and it's under construction They're doing some repairs on it. So they closed it down. So there's no water flowing So we came out here for nothing And then you can go to the high in Canyon no yeah <laughs> What's the one that's close by that you said you're going to oh, that's pretty. That's Where's cool. that? That, that was the that's the waterfall. Got, oh, that is the one. That is it? Yeah. Okay. Give up on my way. Oh, yeah. Hey. Wouldn't it be crazy? Hey. Don't you step and face me? Hey. Wouldn't it be crazy? Hey. Don't you step and face me? sitting outside editing today's video and I just see and realize that I lost all audio whenever I was at the waterfall for almost the rest of the day. So I have no audio for all the clips that I have. Look at this. So when I play this audio clip, nothing. What I have to do is to try and commentate. So I wanna play some of these clips because there was a lot that happened the rest of the day. So I'm gonna to try to commentate and kind of talk you through what happened during these clips and what I was saying. This clip right here, I'm just explaining that we were at this waterfall. I don't remember the name of it. Wasn't saying anything that important. I take out my drone and I started to fly it at the waterfall and I got some really good footage. So check it out, here's the drone footage. started raining hard outside. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to watch, I just set up my computer right below the camera lens and I'm gonna watch these clips and kind of tell you what's going on um, because there's no audio. So this is what's happening. So we're driving back from the waterfall right here. We're on the motorbike and I've been kickstarting it ever since we filled it up the first time in the morning. So I've been kickstarting it all day and I'm at this intersection I'm about to take a right across this busy traffic. It's like a roundabout and nothing at all. Bike completely shuts off. It's an alternator thing, almost positive. Battery and alternator. So completely shuts off. So in the middle of busy, busy traffic, I have to wheel the bike off to the side and I kick start, try to kick start, try to kick start. Bike just has no more juice. I try to pull it out of traffic right here. And again, kick start, kick start, kick start, no juice whatsoever. So finally I realize this thing's not gonna start. I find a spot where I can keep it off to the side. So I just wheel it over to the side and I put it up on its kickstand and I'm leaving it. We know we gotta catch a taxi now. So we say, hey, where can we get your taxi right here? It's not really a busy place with restaurants. Um, before I leave, I take pictures because I don't know the names of these streets. I don't know where I left it, but luckily there was a big statue that was in the middle of this intersection right there. So I took some pictures, yelling for a taxi, doing whatever we can. We hike up this road because this is not a place where there's restaurants where there's a lot of taxis or tourists that hang out. We're like, you know, 10, 10 by seven kilometers outside of town. So here in the intersection, no taxis are coming. I finally put Jordan out there. She can't get a taxi either. And so we cross the road. We start hiking for, I don't know, it had to have been maybe a mile that we walked, trying to find a place where taxis were hanging out. I walked into this convenience store, asked them if they could call a taxi for me and said, hey guys, we broke down. And they said, no, you can't call taxis here. You just have to wave one down. So we left, we left the convenience store. 
we start walking back up the street again and I set down the camera right here to do a time lapse and uh, so we're sitting there I'm running up and down the street trying to catch a taxi uh, and finally at the end Jordan catches a taxi we run over we get back in and audio is back So your guys is, um, I rented a motorbike from here yesterday and it broke down on me about seven kilometers away. Um, I need to talk to your owner, manager, I need to talk to somebody because it broke down. Motorbike here? Or? No, yeah, it's no. seven kilometers away on the oh, side yeah, of the road. Yeah. It's in the middle of the intersection mm -hmm. and it completely broke down, would not go. I tried kickstarting everything and it was very okay, dangerous. You can check, uh, okay, call my friend. Yeah? Yes, you need to call your boss. Intersection with a statue in the middle. Because in the middle Because otherwise we, it would have been like, well, yeah. see you never. The bike that you gave me yesterday, it broke down on us. Very dangerous motorbike in an intersection. It had problems all day. So we had to catch a taxi back to uh, the place here. Uh, the motorbike I showed you, what is that called? What is this? Saka. Tell them. Again, too. Yeah. yeah, I can see. I have no idea where uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. what it's called. I took pictures. I took pictures where I it's left the motorbike. A pretty huh? Uh, see now, and then what are we going? A refund for the second day. Yeah. Yeah. So do I wait till he gets back? Yeah. Okay. okay. When is he back? Uh, maybe uh, a letter. She won't come here. Oh. Okay. Is he back? Uh, not yet. We needed a bike for earlier in the morning because we're going to the rice paddy fields at 6 a.m. Let's see. motorbike broke down we never made it to the rice paddy fields and we never made it to the yoga barn i just got done finishing the video so i'm going to go to bed He escaped from the monkey forest. He's chilling, chilling our neighborhood. He just wanted a little peace and quiet.